Brandon, a short number, minus two and a half in favor of the Tigers. Where are you going? You know, Florida State plays really well in Orlando. You know, Disneyland, you bet. I mean, big news out of Disneyland. Mickey Mouse broke up with Minnie Mouse because she was flat out effing goofy. You know, and there's nothing you can do about that. <laughs> I was nothing like, what? You nothing you can do about that. But you put Florida State in Orlando. Their last 11 games in Orlando, they are 10-0-1 against the number. Last year, I took Florida State plus the points in this matchup and got it done. I will come right back here and take them plus the points. Listen, great year for Chip Kelly. Unbelievable. This is an LSU team that went 2-6 and six against the number down the stretch last year, covering just two of their last eight. Uh-uh. Don't trust. Yeah, listen, Chip, great year. Great to get people feeling good about that. 10-year, $95 million contract, although they overpaid him and he had to pay back a million. I don't think he was certain about that. Give me Florida State. Buy it up to three. Take the Seminoles, plus three. Number eight team in the nation, Florida State at home in this one, Clay. What do you think? Jaden Daniels, LSU all the way. I know they're missing Mason Smith. They're stud defensive linemen suspended for no reason. But LSU is going to take this one. Honestly, I think this one isn't going to be as close as, as people think either. You know, Florida State, they had a solid year last year. I love Jordan Travis, but I, I'm taking LSU by 10. And wow. So I, I think this is a gimme. This might be my lock of the week. I'm taking LSU.